These people know a thing or two about conflict resolution. They're attending the launch of the Dunedin Community Mediation Service. It's an entirely voluntary organisation set up by trustees like Ruth Chapman, a University of Otago mediator. What we're aiming to do is to provide mediation for people who can't normally access it. And it could be of use to just about anybody for help with any kind of disagreement. Mediation, really simple concept. You've got a difficulty with somebody else or some a group within a group and instead of working out who's right and wrong or going to court or staying enemies, uh, we just sit down and have a conversation about it and that's where the mediators come in. A similar service was established about 10 years ago, but it didn't last. Work to replace it began in earnest a couple of years ago and trustees are keen to source funding so the service has a stable future. We hope that the time will come when we can have a paid coordinator and also pay our mediators. Uh, so far we haven't got funding for that, so in the meantime we're launching as a, as a totally voluntary service. There's a handful of trained mediators in Dunedin happy to give their time and talent. They'll conduct mediation in neutral venues like community rooms and centres. Chapman says it's about building a more resilient community overall. We don't want people to feel that their, dis their concern is too little or too big or anything. We want them to contact us and make use of the service because it's for the community. To access the service, people can email trustees through its website or call Community House. Brochures are also being distributed throughout the community. Rosie Mannins, 39 Dunedin News.